Kimber is dying to talk about her sex life. But she shows admirable restraint considering Bonnie is only nine years old. Good job, Kimber. Keep it vague. No need to go into all the squishy details with uh, someone as young as Bonnie. Oh, this is neat stuff, Kimber. Better give them to me. These kind of bracelets can be trouble. So we have a music and magic episode, uh, which means uh, the holograms are not wearing pants. Uh, we have a new uh, character, Astral, a, uh, a student of a student of Houdini. She's not one for the no pants magician rule. But speaking personally, if it's between no pants and bloomers, I'm gonna go with the no pants. But to each their own. So Mrs. Rich Old Woman is uh, holding a charity benefit to build a, a, a children's hospital. And uh, she's a big fan of Houdini, so it's a Houdini magic-themed uh, music performance. Uh, Gem and the Holograms are performing. Astral, uh, Miss Bloomers, is uh, going to perform some Houdini magic, being the uh, student of a student of Houdini. And uh, the Stingers are there trying to get on the show because they want to. And uh, Rapture is over by a uh, Houdini... Uh, mannequin and she's just geeking out over this and she and Minx is sitting there next to her bored as hell and she's like oh my god these are the gloves that Houdini wore isn't that and Minx could not care less <laughs> it's, it's, it's pretty funny uh, also funny is a scene where uh, Kimber still playing with the handcuffs uh, handcuffs herself to Rhea and then can't get out of them and um of course, the introduction of Astral is, ha ha, I've unlocked the cuffs, but I honestly would have thought it was really fu would have been really funny if uh, Kimber and Rhea were just handcuffed to each other the entire episode. Like, it's not even a major focus of the, uh, of the episode or the plot, it's just, they're, just something in the background, that they're just handcuffed to each other, they can't get the damn cuffs off. They have to kind of awkwardly play the keyboard and drums while cuffed together. That would have been really funny to me, but that, that doesn't happen. So, uh, Mrs. Rich Old Woman, uh, she is a superstitious stork sort, uh, which uh, Rapture takes advantage of and says, I am the reincarnation of Houdini. You want to give all your money to me. And sh she does. Meanwhile, Astral and Jam are like, oh my god. Mrs. Rich Old Woman. Uh, Rapture is a con artist. She, she's faking it. But that's the problem with marks for cons is a lot of times marks will not listen to reason in lieu of what they want to be true. So Rapture has a pretty easy time of taking advantage of Mrs. Rich Old Woman. And um, so Astral challenges her to a duel and i'm thinking swords <laughs> no a magic duel and rapture says fine uh the idea being that uh, if you're really the incarnation of houdini you should be able to out magic me so she goes to tech rat to get some rigged uh, magic tricks to compete in the magic duel and well you remember how Tech Rat has been kind of don't touch me kind of guy? He and uh, Minx seem to be getting along okay. Is that for me? Especially for you. Oh. So, you know, nice that the uh, nice that uh, uh, Tech Rat has found someone he's comfortable with, and uh, maybe Minx will leave Rio the hell alone. So, um. They do the uh, magic show, and uh, the, the big tech rat gimmick is the 
water torture tank where you're locked in a tank full of water and suspended upside down. And what TechRat built was a bracelet for Minx, which is a control module which unlocks the various uh, cuffs and padlocks and the, the, the foot bindings and all the things that are holding the uh, magic trick together. So all she has to do is just press a button on the bracelet, uh, Rapture will be released, and ha-ha, I escaped! Wee, I'm awesome, I am the incarnation of Houdini. Well, uh, some excited audience member spills their orange juice on the bracelet and shorts it out, so Rapture drowns. No, they, they actually, uh, uh, Astral picks all the locks by hand and drags her out of the tank. And so Rapture confesses, it was all a hoax, it was all a game, I was just playing. And, um, so the Stingers, you know, wander off with their tails between their legs. And, uh, Mrs. Rich Old Woman is, oh, I'm so embarrassed. And, uh, Astral says, well, let's, let's, let's do a magic trick. Here, here's a cage. Uh, get in there, Mrs. Rich Old Woman. And she locks the cage and she says, okay, now you stay in there and you think about what you've done. No, she uh, does an, a super impressive magic trick. She takes a giant sheet and she flings it over and gets it to cover the, uh, the, the entire cage. First try. I can't do that with a sheet on my bed. I like, foom, and it just all bunches up and twists over itself. So that is genuinely the most impressive magic trick I have ever seen. And then she removes the, the sheet, and there's a tiger in the cage, and Mrs. Rich Old Woman is sitting in the audience. That's pretty cool, too. But actually flipping the sheet and covering the cage in one try, that, that, that's what impressed me the most. So. Uh, fun little episode. I enjoyed it. Uh, uh, Astral is introduced with a uh, reprise of She's Got the Power, which was initially about synergy, but uh, works really well. It's a great song, so I liked it. Uh, the Stingers sing Mind Games, which is a really great song. I, I really like the, uh, the, uh, the harmonies on the chorus. It sounds really, really nice. We're playing mind games, mind games, stretching your mind till it snaps. We like to play mind games, mind games, mind games, making the whole thing collapse. And then there's a, uh, Stingers and Gem, uh, collaboration called Believe, Don't Believe, where they're singing at Mrs. Rich Old Woman to either, you know, believe uh, Rapture's bullcrap or don't believe Rapture's bullcrap. And that's a, that, that's a nice, nice tune, too. So, good songs, good songs. All right. So, that is episode 61? Oh. We've only got four episodes left? Oh. I'm, I'm I'm feeling really anxious because it's almost over. Your charity event will not be complete without the Stingers as its musical performers. Young man, I already have musical performers for my benefit. They're called Gem and the Holograms. Good day.